my internet friends, it's another week, another vlog, and we actually didn't do a lot of vlogging this week, so I thought that maybe I'd take you along with me to do some last minute vlogging this Sunday. So here we go, here's the recap, and was the toilet thing a bit too much? Anyways, here's the vlog, what we did this week, and we'll get back to me uh, later today, because we have to do this in order, so let's go. Hello. What's up guys, it is, what's today, Monday? Huh? Yeah, it's uh, Monday the 9th. Monday. And it's 10.40 and... Ooh. But we are here tonight to see... Fast Five. Heard it's good, so here we go. Let's hope it's good. Yeah. Alright. We are the only people here. It's the 100 seat theater though, it's the small one. So... We can sit, we can literally sit anywhere we want. I'm gonna lie down. <laughs> Alright, but we're gonna wait for this movie to start. This is just really cool. No one's in here! It's, uh... Okay. But, yeah, that was Neil Patrick Harris. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and watch this movie, guys. I might, uh... I knew I knew that person. Okay. <laughs> but alright, we're gonna go ahead and enjoy this movie. Hopefully it's good. I like the Fast and the Furious movies, so hopefully this is really, really good. So, later guys. Say bye. Say bye. Huh? Say bye. Huh? Bye. Bye. Ah! Bye. Bye. Hey guys, uh, we are now leaving the theater. Well, we just, just left. No, don't. I know Come it's. Oh, there's no one here. Yeah, but no, we're not breaking no rules. Yeah, I don't care if there's no one around. You never know. Might be a cop park right there with the lights off. Okay. But anyways, um, yeah, we just left the theater. Watched Fast and Furious Five. Loved it. I, I really do. I think the reason I really enjoyed it a lot more was because of the fact that I've watched all of the Fast and the Furious movies. I liked some more than others, but I just really enjoyed that in this one they really made a lot of throwbacks to the other movies, a lot of references to the first and second movie and so on and so forth. One thing that I, I've heard a lot of people buzzing around online was like, they don't understand that Han uh, the Asian guy, why he's still in here, because he was in the last one, and then now he's in this one, they're like, doesn't he die in Tokyo? Well, technically, Tokyo Drift happens after this movie, so, yeah. It still sucks, because Han's one of my favorite characters next to, uh, next to Brian. I don't know about you guys, but to me, I don't know, I prefer Brian over Dom. I just really like his character, the whole ex-cop thing, I don't know, I, I kind of like that twist. What about you? I like the biker chick the best. I don't care biker what you chick. say. <laughs> biker chick was hot. Biker chick was hot. Smoking. Girls and motorcycles, man. <laughs> um, a lot of it was over the top, but still, I really liked it. Seeing The Rock square off with Vin Diesel was... Oh my god. That was pretty epic. That I was, love that part. Like, I like how it sort of played out. It if you like he was about to kill him. Yeah, he did. It did kind of ruin it for me anyway, since I watched all the other movies. I kind of had a sense of what was going to happen and how it was going to go, but that still didn't ruin it for me. I just That just made me more excited, if anything. But I think it's a good way to end the series. And I'm not going to tell you what. You're going to have to go and watch the movie yourself, but after the initial beginning part of the credits, like the main credits, it's like a minute after it ends, there's like this whole credit sequence with um, a Challenger and a GTR driving, it's animated and stuff. After that, at the end of the movie, stick around, because after that, there's a small snippet, and it has Eva Mendes' character in it from the second Fast and the Furious movie, and she comes in, and something happens, but that's all I'm going to tell you. You're gonna have to go and see it for yourself to figure it out. But yeah, I think it was awesome. So that's uh, pretty much it for right now. We're gonna go home. I'm gonna get this vlog up. Tiffany's gonna go to bed. And I'm probably gonna play Need for Speed or something with driving because I just I just get that urge every time I... He wanted to drive home. I yeah, I wanted to drive home and she said no, which is smart. <laughs> Getting my license soon. So yeah, um, anyways, it's probably not gonna be for everybody, but if you've been a fan of Fast and the Furious since the first one and have followed all the movies until now, then you'll like it and you'll like all the references, you'll know exactly what everyone's on about and it'll mean a lot more to you. So if you've been a fan or seen the first couple movies and liked them, go watch Fast Five. You won't regret it, you'll really like it. I did. So yeah, now we're gonna go home. So, later. What's up guys, it is Saturday. I know, we just skipped a whole bunch of days this week, I'm sorry. Frustrations again with this thing, uh, the walk and talk. I'm rendering it again now. I don't know, it's like one of two things happen. 
when it renders. It'll reach about halfway or a little bit past halfway and then it'll fail. Like it'll say some error or something. Or it'll render all the way through and when I play it back before I upload, like full questions or full, yeah, full scenes will be just completely blank black screens you'll hear me like you'll hear me talking it's happened in other videos you'll hear me talking but nothing you don't see anything you don't see the question pop up nothing it's just black screen and i don't know what causes that uh it's happened to the last couple of videos so i don't know like well not not to an extent like there's some videos in the past where it happened to like a minute or a couple seconds worth of uh footage it's just black but in this one it's like full questions because the way i would do the walk and talk to make sure during editing, the editing process that makes it easier on me is after I answer a question, I'll stop recording, then I'll start recording for a new question, so on and so forth, that way I'll know which question and answer is each individual piece of footage. So full sections of those would be like missing, and yeah. So I'm trying to render it again. If it doesn't work, I'm gonna try to uninstall Sony Vegas and reinstall it, see if that works. Maybe there's some sort of thing wrong with it, I don't know. But I'm cooped up inside the house, this room's a mess, I have to clean it, and I want to go out, and me and Steven are supposed to shoot a germ video today, and I really want to. Luckily, it was raining last night and not right now, so we might have a chance to. I just gotta try rendering this one more time, and we'll see after that. No one's been online, it's been kind of, it's been kind of a boring morning, and it's... This is honestly shaping up to be a very boring vlog, I know. But if anything, I do have one other thing to show you guys. You want to see what I'm drinking? You want to see what I'm drinking? You want to see what I'm drinking? Uh, if you're going to say balls, no. This is going to be a shocker. Water. I am drinking me some H2O, and it's pretty good. You got to drink this stuff chilled. <laughs> I actually had a scare this morning um, while I was waiting for this to render earlier because uh, I tried rendering it again this morning, and it failed. And I, I had a scare because I woke up this morning and I had two coffees. And I know that's bad because uh, you guys already know Balls has guarana. Guarana has a lot of caffeine. And I drank a lot of it. That's like way too much. And again, I'm sorry that I drank so much Balls. It's just that like Monster, Red Bull, all those other energy drinks, they burn. Like just the, the carp, I don't know what it is. I think it's the fizziness in it or, or something, but it burns when you drink that stuff. I don't know why I liked it so much. Balls doesn't. It's smooth going down. I'm like an energy drink connoisseur almost. In fact, let's give this a test. Tell me some things you like to do. Like tell me if you do a lot of schoolwork or if you play a lot of sports or whatever. Tell me in the comment section below. I'll recommend you an energy drink. I'm that kind of a connoisseur. No, let's not do that. Don't drink a lot of energy drinks because again, as I said earlier before I went off on a tangent, I had a scare this morning. I drank so much caffeine last week because of all the balls I drank and this morning I had two coffees and I, the other day I just finished the last bottle of balls and I don't think I'll be getting another case honestly because this morning after I had that second coffee, I had a pain in my chest like right here. And I don't know what it was, and my heart was beating really, really fast, and yeah. So, I know I shouldn't have drank all that energy drink last week. I know, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry, guys. I feel like I really let you down, because I, I did tell you, I did, I did tell you I would only drink like one a day, and I completely went against that, all because of this thing frustrating me. And I know it's not an excuse. It's not an excuse. Should it be an excuse? But, yeah, that's what happened. And I got really nervous. I didn't know what it was. It was a really bad pain. It was kind of hard to breathe. Heart was beating really fast. So it's probably all that caffeine. Honestly, that's that's really what I'm thinking it is. So yeah, I like poured out the last of my supposedly third cup of coffee, iced coffee. This time I poured that out because I was like, no, I'm not doing this anymore. And I'm drinking water. So I'm going to try and get off energy drinks completely. I know I've said that before. I've said that like last year I said I was going to get off energy drinks. That pain really sucked. And then I drank the water and it was fine. So I really don't know what it is. I'm just going to say it's the caffeine to scare me into getting off of these energy drinks. I may get another case of balls. I'm not going to lie. I don't know. I really like this stuff. But I, I don't know. I don't know. Leave me in the comments if you guys think it's okay. Uh, really. Because I'm, I'm kind of torn. 
I'm thinking if I get another case, I will be very serious about drinking one a day, but we already know what happened last time I said that. So yeah, let me know what you guys think, like what that pain was or if I should get another case. But other than that, uh, I have to finish trying to render this, contact Steven and see if we're doing another germ video today. But anyways, this is shaping up to be a long Saturday vlog and I still have to go see Steven, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here. Hopefully this next scene I'm in, I'm with Steven and we're about to shoot the germ video. If not, it's probably gonna be future me doing the recap and I certainly hope that's not the case because boring vlog is gonna be boring this week. Yeah. Not all of them. When it comes to vlogs, not every single one is gonna be a gem, but, you know, it still kinda sucks. When you're doing vlogs, especially if you're a daily person, not every day is going to be a gem, but the fact that you do it and you take your time to do it, I think is uh, important. So, sorry if it's boring, guys, but I'll try to make up for it like later today if I get to meet up with Steven. So, later. And there you go. That's pretty much uh, all we did or I did last week. I reinstalled my editing software, so it's working now. So hopefully this vlog won't have any problems during uh, rendering. And there goes my phone. <laughs> But right now, I'm about to go into Walmart uh, and uh, get some errands done, pick up some stuff, and then I gotta go to the ATM, get some monies, and it's back home. So, let me go do this, since you already know Walmart doesn't let me film in there, and we'll talk a little bit more, so uh, stay tuned, like, for a split second, because it'll jump cut to it, like, right now. And there we go, uh, we, I just got out of Walmart, I'm now across the street, just got done with the ATM, I have my money now, for rent, and, yeah. Now it's about time to go home, but I'm gonna stop probably over there at Little Caesars and get a pizza for everyone. Five dollars for a large, can't beat that. And yeah, my lips are so chapped. I just noticed my lips were so chapped in the walk and talk. I am so embarrassed by that, but I can't wear lip balm because every lip balm I've ever tried, I always break out like a, an allergic reaction. My lips feel funny and I get a rash around it. it I can't wear lip balm. It sucks. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm gonna go do this, head home. We'll talk a little bit, maybe. I don't know, but yeah, I'll see you guys there. Hello, you guys, okay, and... All right, so I just got back, obviously, and just so you guys know, I'm not a reckless driver, even though I know I shouldn't be driving. Well, when I do go out to do stuff like this, run errands or, or whatnot, I know it takes one idiot to really mess you up. Like, I could be driving as safe as possible, but just one person hits me and it's all over. I know this, I know, but I do what I can to prevent it. And I know there's really not much I can do, but like when I go out, I don't take the main streets. I take the side streets, like through the neighborhoods and whatnot. So, I do what I can. So, I don't, I'm not reckless, guys. You know me. But other than that, PlayStation Network has finally come back. The store is not working yet, but the network is up. So I'm gonna get on here and catch up with some people. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to eat, play something, catch up, and all that other good stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys with that. I'm sorry for the lame vlog uh, this week. But pretty soon, next couple weeks, Danny will be here and I promise it's a guarantee, actually, that the vlogs are going to be pretty... Well, they're going to pick up a lot, and the skits will be coming back, because she's going to be helping me write out skits and stuff and get me out of this whole writer's block, mental block thing that I've been going through. But I might have another skit maybe in the next couple weeks before she gets here. So I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this week, you guys. Thank you for sticking around and for all your support. Don't forget to check out the uh, latest podcast uh, that I did with Mike or the latest walk and talk, which took me forever to get uploaded. But other than that, you guys, I want each and every single one of you to know that all of you are the best friends and subscribers in the entire world. And as always, you guys, keep on vlogging. Let's